Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. How the heck have you been? Today I'm back with a super exciting video. It's something different. I have a couple vlogs that I've done like home decor, but I, I don't know if I have a dedicated video to like one room. Um, so today we're redoing my master bedroom. This is going to be, I'm going to think I'm going to call this a realistic like mini bedroom makeover. And what I mean by realistic is like affordable, budget friendly. Okay, you're not gonna find items from Restoration Hardware. This is a little bit more budget friendly. Um, I just wanted to kind of change up the vibe in that room. What I had before didn't really flow. I guess it did, I don't know. I just didn't like it. I wanted to do all new. I wanted to bring in the neutrals and a lot more of like the wood um, type of tone. So that's what we did. I'm super excited about it you probably already know what it looks like because of the thumbnail but I wanted to do the whole before and after thing you know but yeah let me know what your thoughts are let me know if you like this video at the end give it a thumbs up that way I know to film more like home decor DIY types of projects and I do include footage of me redoing the dresser so I'm gonna do that to an old Ikea dresser so stay tuned for that but uh yeah I hope you guys enjoy it thanks so much for watching and uh let's get into it So guys, I want to go ahead and redo the dresser. This is from Ikea. I will have it listed down below if you're interested in it. But I want to go ahead and upscale, upcycle, whatever they call it, this dresser um, to go with the flow of the bedroom. I want to paint the base of it all white, and then I want to do the top like a stain. And I can do that because if you look... If you look inside, if you have a dresser from Ikea and it has like the wood on the inside, then you know you can sand this and then stain it. So that's just like a little tip on whether you're like, can I stain this dresser, can I not? That's what I went by. I went, I have like so many things on Pinterest that I was reading up on, but I wanna go ahead and paint it white. I'm going to replace out the knobs. I don't know what knobs yet, I don't even have any. I'm gonna probably go after this tonight and see what different knobs that I want. And then I wanna stain the top of the dresser. Um, I wanted to do something that was a little bit more of like a new neutral undertone and not so like oaky, oaky, more like oak that has like the orange, you know, undertone to it. So this is what I went with and hopefully it turns out that way. And then I'm also going to go ahead and sand the top so that way I can apply the stain and then the rest I'm just going to paint. So I do have a little electric, you know, hand sander. I'm just going to be using just a plain white paint. This is ultra white. I wanted it to be I would say tossing up between like a more like eggshell, like beigey white, you know what I mean? Or like a bright white. And I think I want like a bright white. Um, so this is what I went with. It has primer and paint built into it. So hopefully that works. I'm hoping this goes well. I have no idea how this is going to go. So um, let's go ahead and get started. Every time I'm with you, it's like a holiday. We Sanding is no joke. It's literally all over me. This is no joke. Like, this is serious work. I've been at it maybe about like an hour now. This is where I'm at. Okay. It's definitely hard. I mean, I'm getting there, but my God. So much work. My arms, my pipe cleaners are killing me. Like, what do I lift weights for? And I, I have like no upper body strength. I got dust everywhere on my nose. Oh my God. This is hard. I'm not a pop drinker, but today. I need something. Plus I wanted to do my lawn and my weed whacking, but. It's like 2.30. I don't know if I'm going to get that done. Oh, so much to do, so little time. I'm going to get back to standing, but I had to let you guys know. If you guys, if you're a girl and you're doing this on your own, may the force be with you because it is so hard. 
Good luck to you if you guys ever sand anything, but I'm gonna get back to it. I used to have solid curtains over here, so I switched the long one from here to here, and then I got other shears shorter because I'm going to put the bed under there, so I think that good. We're talking about the difference in the rods. Yeah, I'm going to have to change that. You know what I mean? <laughs> Sometimes hardwoods. I wood. told you I like carpet. Oh I my like, god, I freaking love this. I like carpet and I like drapes better because drapes are more homey and cozy too. Oh my god. You guys, look how beautiful this is. I'm gonna link, the, I'm gonna have try and link everything down below for you guys, but look how beautiful this is. Look at the color. It's like I can pull. You can pull sage green. You green, beiges. I know, it's almost like a terracotta shade, like a. Mm -hmm with like a little bit of pink in it. Oh right. my God, it's beautiful. I like this centerpiece. See those? Yeah, I love those. You didn't get this, you didn't see all no, the knickknacks like I bought. I didn't see that in the bowl. I know. I, I just things. kept buying little by little. One, two, three. Yeah. Just look at the these look so pretty on it because it kind of like ties in the warm the dark oh my god you would never know this is an Ikea look how beautiful is it an Ikea? 
This is an Ikea. I just well, redid no wonder, it. It's not fit right. I know. I know. But honestly, for a nice, quick upgrade, mm -hmm. I got a spot. I got to get that. But wow. That looks beautiful. I can't wait to get I'm going to, at some point, these bother me. I'm getting new ones, white ones. But for now, I just act like that's not there. today's video i hope you enjoyed it give me a thumbs up if you did and let me know do you want to see more videos like this like home decor kind of um room makeover kind of like vlog <laughs> type of videos uh let me know i know you guys want to see vlogs and i'm trying so hard to like vlog periodically it's just i don't do a lot so let me know if you guys like these types of videos. I'll definitely film more. I do want to go ahead and redo my little guest room, um, and I could film it for you guys if you would like to see it. So let me know down below. Let me know what your thoughts are on this little room transformation. And uh, as always, I appreciate you guys always watching my videos and for the constant support. I'll see you very soon in my next video. Bye.